Blood transfusions aren't just giving blood. Each product has a completely different job. Okay, so let's break this down without making it too complicated. First up are our PRBCs packed red blood cells. This is all about oxygen delivery. We give PRBCs when hemoglobin is low, there's acute blood loss, or the patient is symptomatic. So think fatigue, tachycardia, hypotension, shortness of breath. PRBCs do not fix any kind of clotting, they just carry oxygen. Next up, platelets. These ones are all about clot formation. We give them when platelet levels are low, or the patient is actively bleeding with thrombocytopenia. Some common situations would be with chemotherapy patients, massive hemorrhages, or certain autoimmune conditions. And third, fresh frozen plasma, FFP. This one confuses a lot of people. So plasma replaces clotting factors, not red blood cells. We use it for active bleeds with clotting factor deficiencies like liver failure or conditions like DIC. If the INR is high and they're bleeding, think plasma. Now, cryoprecipitate or cryo. This is a more concentrated clotting product. It is rich in fibrinogen. We give it when fibrinogen is low, like in massive hemorrhage, DIC, or postpartum hemorrhage. So a quick little summary over here, PRBCs give oxygen, platelets cause clotting of the cells, plasma has clotting factors, and then cryo is a big fibrinogen boost. Each product serves a different purpose. If you want a free study guide that breaks this down with indications, lab triggers, and nursing considerations, comment transfusion down below and I will send that right to your DMs.